Hello, this is my uh, 1994 Mercedes E320 with the M104 engine and W124 chassis. Today when I turn on the car I got the check engine light and uh, what I'm going to show you guys is how to diagnose this problem and if it's not too serious we can actually reset that that uh, check engine light. So um, the first thing we're going to do is uh, I'm going to shut off the car again and then you turn the switch all the way to the right so that you get all the lights on. You don't have to start it. Then um, we're going to go to the engine compartment and I'll show you where the trick is. Uh, before you start doing this, you should go to the internet and download the uh, DTC code listing. DTC, DTC stands for Diagnostic Troubleshooting Codes and it's going to look something like this. And uh, the 1994 models have this built-in uh, diagnostics port. I guess this was before the OBD2 uh, scanners came on board. So this one has built-in already. So there's this little port here by the battery and there's a cover there. And you, there's a little push button switch. And you're going to hold that for about four seconds. 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. You release it and then um, there's going to be a the LEDs there is going to start flashing and uh, let's do that again okay so we're going to press the button for uh, two seconds or so two to four seconds actually no. one two three four Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Okay, twenty-six flashes. Okay, so now you want to come to your listing. And 26 says upshift delay faulty. Okay, this is not a big deal. The upshift delay basically uh, delays the transmission from shifting uh, between uh, second and third gears, and that's to help out with the emissions out here in California. So uh, I choose not to uh, do anything about this, so we're just going to clear it. And the way to clear it is you have to read the code again, and once that's finished, you have to press the button between uh, 8 to 10 seconds uh, after the 26 flashes and uh, that will clear the code and clear the, uh, the uh, light. So let's give it a go. There it goes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 20. All right, so now I'm going to hold it for about eight seconds. 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000, 8,000. 9,000, 10,000. Okay, so that was 10 seconds, and there the LED goes off. So now we can put the cap back on. So now we'll go back inside the car, and the check engine should be off when I start it. Okay, so it's on right now because all the lights will go off. Comes on again, and there it is. Okay, the check engine light is now gone. So that's it, how to troubleshoot your check engine light.